Well, today it was the first day of school for several school systems across the area, although today is seen as a fresh start. Teacher shortages continue to plague many districts. NBC Local 33's Rachel Riley tells us how they are forced to bring in teacher trainers to fill the gaps. We are still seeing an uptick in numbers, unfortunately. New school year, same problems. Louisiana Association of Educators President Dr. Tia Mills says districts across the state are still having a difficult time recruiting enough teachers. In, in many districts, a large uh, amount of vacancies some of them with over 100. She says it boils down to a lack of support, appreciation, and pay. We didn't go into this profession for the pay that, I mean, everyone knows that. However, at the same time, we didn't go into this profession to be close to uh, being in poverty either. East Baton Rouge Superintendent Cito Narcisse says they're already coming into the year with a deficit. For teachers, about uh, just, uh, just under 78 right now vacancies, which has been huge for us. However, when looking at the EBR school system job site, it shows nearly 200 teacher vacancies as of today. To help fill the positions of districts like EBR, they're calling instructional coaches back to the classrooms. Some of our math and literacy coaches and told them that they'd have to go back and, and uh, teach some classes and also coach at the same time. It's unfortunate that we have to go to those measures. Bill says there needs to be better pay and incentives to bring educators back. If they do not feel value, then they're going to go somewhere where they are valued. Rachel Riley, NBC Local 33 News. Now, we reached out for clarification on the vacancy numbers for EBR schools, but we haven't heard back yet. We'll let you know when we do. All right, let's check in with.